I don't know if I would give this weirdo the money from the anyways. At the end of the video, I don't know if you guys listen to it or not. He said, and they're creating a GoFundMe page. Like, bitch, this girl just passed away, man. Your fiance, whatever, your wife, you're supposed to get married. Don't make a big money thing about it, bro. This guy made a big old money thing about it. Probably went to the news, you know what I'm saying? You know how you know how did the news find out? They made a GoFundMe page. I'm glad they didn't give him his money back, bro. I mean, they went too far when they started posting on social media. Like, I'm glad you, I uh, hope you cry all day about this. Blah, blah, blah. You know, that was a little bit too far. But, dude, asking refunds about, you know, about the wedding is not bad either. But if somebody chooses not to give you money back because of, for whatever reason, because they did their goddamn job and tried to help you with your wedding... Uh, that's up to them. That's a personal choice. That's a business. Half the ghetto has businesses out here. They don't give your money back. You can go to a hotel, ghetto ass hotel out here. They can give you your money back. I mean, you can fight for it, but that's, that's, that's up to them. You know what I mean? I was at a hotel the other day. That's long. I had a lot of bugs in it. I tried to get my money back. They, they said no. Okay, I'm gonna go on my way because. You know, I've called the cops before on a ho on a on a place like a hotel type place, and they said, "Oh, that's just bad business, sir. We can't do anything about it. They can't. The cops can't do anything about it because it's just that's just how business is. They, they don't have to give you your money back. You know what I mean? So that's just how it is. Ugh. Um, you know, stop, stop making a. Uh, A money thing about it. You're you're white, bro.